Hey, Word Nerds, my name's Kenny. Hope you're all feeling good today. It is Thursday, June 6th. In this video, we're gonna play four New York Times games. We got Wordle, Connections, The Mini Crossword, and Strands. If you guys are new here, I do play these games every single day. So if you wanna watch me play these games, hit the subscribe button. Uh, we'll begin with Wordle. First thing we're gonna do is uh, select a random word to use as my starting guess. I've been doing this every single day. Um, so let's go ahead and find out together what word I get today. These are from Wordle's answer list, so let's see what we get. Cream. All right, that's a very good starting guess, I think. Okay, so let's go ahead and put in cream. We'll see what it gets me. Here we go. Uh, an R and an E. Okay, that's uh, it's not bad. Uh, this could end in ER, or it could end in RE. Or it could be something like reply. I mean, that wouldn't be a bad guess. But I do want to try something probably that ends in ER. Probably the, like, O oh, something ER like this. Because you got, like, poker. You got, like, um, a lot of things are eliminated. Like, mower or um, things with an M, like Homer. Uh, so... We could do rower just to see where that R goes, but I don't think I really need to. Um, it could also be an I, like biker or something. I don't know which one has more possibilities, an O or an I in that second position. Uh, let's go with uh, let's go with toner. Let's use that O. I don't know if a T is gonna be. Oh, I was good, I was literally just about to say I don't know if the T is gonna be the best letter to to put here, but. I guess it's it's it works out nice. So, so I'm gonna say the T is gonna go here. So something T E R. It's not an A. So there's no water. There's no later. Um. So it doesn't have to go there. Like the T could go here. Yeah, I guess it could be steer. It could easily be steer. In fact, that makes a little bit more sense than using an I or a U. Because I don't see a lot of I don't see a lot of words that I mean there's biter, I guess, but like none of these words are like great words that I think are gonna be on Wordle's answer list. Um even this, like I don't really see it a whole lot. So um actually going with a, a T like steer is just probably the I think this is probably the highest odds of being the answer. So let's put it in. Okay, never mind. The E is not in the middle position. Okay, there's a flaw in my thinking. I was I was uh, not looking back at what I have already entered. I just kind of assumed <laughs> that, uh, yeah, I don't know why I did that. Sorry, that was bad. So this starts with E. That was, okay, I mean, this mistake actually helped me out tremendously because I don't know uh, if I would have even figure this out. I guess it's ether. Is that ether or ether? I actually don't know how to pronounce that word. I don't even know what it is. Um, but okay, there we go. That is the wordle for today. No, that was not even close to being an answer that I thought it was going to be. I thought for sure it was going to be like something I E R at the end or O blank E R. So, um, yeah. Um, I just, <laughs> that mistake. I, I mean, you know, I'm kind of glad I made the mistake. It helped me out. Uh, okay. Uh, now, that is Wordle. Uh, be sure to leave a comment on the video. Let me know. Uh, let me know how you guys did on this. Um, we got connections next. So let's go ahead and, and get started over there. All right. Here we go. Connections, June 6th. Let's go ahead and get started and see what words we got today. We got... Marble, baseball, drive wild, drive wild, okay. Um, Jim Park. A couple of interesting words. You got grapefruit, you got dugout, courtroom, a couple of compound words there. Okay. Skip, reverse, and wild. These are like cards from like a game. I think Uno? 
You got like draw a draw card, like draw four, I guess. These are definitely playing cards, or, or they're like a game, like cards in like a game. Yeah, let's put that in. Yeah, Uno cards. Okay, nice. Um, baseball dugout. Those go together. Park, like a ballpark. I, I feel like that's not going to be the category. I feel like there's going to be something else, but I, I got I to gotta explore it first just to see. Yeah, I don't know. Okay, so these words kind of seem similar, like push, propel, maybe even drive, prompt. I don't know if they all four go together, but you can prompt somebody to do something and push them, drive them. I, yeah, I guess propel works in the same way. Yeah, let's put that in. Okay, I wasn't sure at first if they all meant the same thing, but... um. Now what, though? I can already tell this purple one's going to be a little weird. <laughs> um, P, marble, grapefruit, baseball, things that are spheres, spherical, round. Um... Park, gym, courtroom, dugout. I mean, those are places, so I, I can see these being two different categories. I mean, this kind of makes sense. I'm going to put this in to see. Hail, size comparisons. I don't... I, I, I never would have guessed that. I Yeah, I did not realize that these were common hail comparisons. I didn't know that that was a thing. I don't know if I just don't watch the Weather Channel enough, or I don't know. <laughs> I don't. If it hails, like I really don't pay attention to stuff like this. Okay. The baseball one, I think I've heard, but grapefruit—that's pretty big. Okay. Uh, next, a dugout, gym, park, in a courtroom. Okay, so these are all places, but what do they all have in common? What connects them? Dugout. I mean, that's like your bench for like baseball players. I mean, is it just bench? Yeah, gym, there's a bench press. Park, yeah, you just have benches in the park. And then courtroom, the bench is a term that refers to um, something. I guess I don't really know it specifically, but... You just call it the bench or like, I don't know. Uh, all right. I think it's bench. Places with benches. There we go. Okay. Yeah. So this one is just the, I mean, the I just didn't know the hail size one specifically, but I just kind of put them all together because they were round <laughs> or spheres or whatever, which, okay. I wonder, I'm assuming that a lot of people are just going to put them together because of their shape. Um, I'm sure most people are not going to specifically get the hail size thing, but maybe you do. I don't know. Let me know if you got the hail size one specifically because uh, I did not, that did not come to mind. Um, okay. Well, there is connections. Not, not a hard one today. I'd say, I'd say this one was pretty easy. Um, Uno one was a little weird because like you have like draw, draw two or just plus two or whatever it is. Draw four. I don't think you just have a card that's just draw, but... Um, okay. Uh, we got the mini crossword next. So let's go ahead and uh, open that up. We'll do that. Okay, here we go. Mini crossword, Thursday, June 6th. Let's get started and see what we got today. Good way to get in shape. In more than one way? Huh? What does this mean? And, and, and this, this might 
this might be my brain just being dirty, but why do I have some sort of inappropriate thoughts coming to mind right now? <laughs> okay. Um, anyway, moving on. Uh, British nobility title. British nobility title. I'm not familiar with nobility terms. I mean, you got like queen, maybe. Yeah, that's a five-letter word. I mean, we'll have to see when we get to five down if it starts with a Q. But I, I mean, like, I don't, I don't know stuff like that. Heaven help us. Oh God! I mean, that makes sense, kind of. I mean, the word heaven's in there. God. I, I, I have no idea. What a cat resembles when it sits with its legs tucked under its body. It resembles something? Oh, man. What? I don't know. I feel like, oh, God. There, like, there's no way, oh, God is right. I mean, I guess I guess it makes sense. I guess I'm not totally wrong for putting that in, but it's an expression, right? The, the clue for six across is in quotes. So, I mean... I guess it could be right. Blank Quixo? I have no idea what that is. What is this word? Cer Cervantes? Cervantes? Epic? Cervantes? It's a name, isn't it? Uh, I forget what an epic is. An epic? Is, is it like a story? Um... Google alternative, um, what's an alternative to Google? We're talking about, wait, are we talking about the search web, uh, search, search, did I say weapon? Search engine. Are we talking about the search engine website, Google, or are we talking about the company Google is like a tech company? I'm assuming they're talking about the search engine. But I mean, I, I mean, I can think about Bing, but Bing's four letters. So like, what's five letters? So oh God's probably wrong then, because like I mean, I guess there could be something with an H. I I, I don't. I I I've got nothing. I've got nothing on this one today. There's nothing. Heaven help me. Heaven help us. No. Heaven help me on this crossword today. I can't do this. I can't get anything today. Instrument at a bat best. Hold on. Words, man. What it? I gotta like break out the dictionary today. Basilica. What the heck is that? Or a baseball stadium. What's an instrument at a baseball stadium? Because I don't know what the other thing is. Instrument? Are we just talking about instrument in the loose term, like a tool? Or are we specifically talking about musical musical instrument? I'm assuming we're just talking about music, like, or, or we're not talking about music. I'm assuming we're just talking about, like, an, an item, an object that you use. Like a baseball bat. A glove. Oh, a glove? Wait a minute. Does that make sense? Uh, is that an instrument? No, it's just, it's, I don't know. Silly mistake, a goof. Be wrong. Your point is, and, I, think, I mean, that makes sense. Yeah, okay, so this could be, oh God. Okay, so. I, I don't get any of this. Good way to get in shape. Yoga? Oh, because it's supposed to be, like, good for your mind? Is that what they're trying to go for? Oh, Yahoo? Okay. I, f I just forgot about that. I forgot that it existed. <laughs> Not gonna lie. I just forget that it existed. Um, okay. Of course, it's the last clues that I read that I get to, that I actually get. So then, I mean, now I gotta go back and, and do the rest of these. Um, oh, what is this tune? Baron? Organ? 
Uh, there's an or what? How does that have anything to do with baseball? Oh, like this text. I didn't even see. I didn't even get to this one yet. Why did I not do that? Um, loaf. What is loaf for? What does that mean? What is a cat? Or is that what is a loaf? Like, I mean, obviously a loaf of 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 uh, of bread, but like, how does a cat represent a loaf? Okay. Hold on a minute. I'm typing in loaf. Yeah, I know about the idea of like loafing around, but like. What? I don't, I don't like that one. I don't get it. I mean, I don't know. Maybe it makes sense and I just don't get it, but like, I don't like it. If I do get it, then I don't like it. <laughs> Don... What is that? I have no idea what that is. Okay, I guess I gotta look up Don Quicksoat. I don't even know if I'm saying- I don't even know what the Quicksoat means. Is that just a last name? I guess it's probably just a name, right? This one was tough. This one was really tough. I didn't know, like, half of these. It's a novel. Miguel de Cervantes. Okay, so I was kind of pronouncing it right because I- it's- it looked Spanish to me. Um... Don Quixote is a Spanish epic novel. I should read that. I should read that in Spanish. <laughs> I'm trying to learn Spanish right now. Um, yeah, Baron. I I mean, yes, I've I'm familiar with the word, but I was not going to come up with that. Okay, I mean, yeah, if I was just better at. Okay, I guess Basilica, I can look that up. What the, what the heck is that? Basilica? Sorry, this video, like, my videos are turning into a research session. <laughs> I gotta look stuff up. I'm just, I apologize if, like, this isn't interesting to you. If you just want to watch me solve the puzzles, then go ahead and skip forward or back or whatever you want to do. Um, I, uh, I, I need to... Basilica, it looks like a, a building of some sort. A large public building. Greek East. What? It's like a church? Is it a church? What is Basilica versus Cathedral? Okay, so it's basically like a big church or something. A big building. Uh, I didn't realize that organs were like really popular at baseball games. Like I know, I know that, I know the, the like... The, the the sound that is common at a baseball game, I'm not going to, I can't do musical stuff, so I'm not going to make the sound, but I didn't realize that they actually have organs at baseball stadiums, like, I just, I didn't realize, what? I, okay. <laughs> um, yeah, this was just, uh. This, this was, this was, this was tough, so. For me, because I don't know a lot of things, but all right. Um, yeah, we'll move on. We'll play the final game here. Uh, we got strands, so let's go ahead and open that up. Fun. I mean, the, the mini was fun. I mean, it's just I don't know the things. <laughs> I just <laughs> struggle with it. Okay, here we go. Strands, uh, Thursday, June 6th. Let's go ahead and uh, get started. We'll see what the theme is today. The theme today is title treasures title treasures it's like glass yeah okay stone yep mm. glass stone bead no Floss. I didn't think that was going to be the word, but I just, I was like, two S's here? What is that going to be? Unless it's like, hmm, not sure actually. Beach. I mean, that could be, 
Uh, that could be um, the beginning of, of the spangram. Okay, if that's the beginning of the spangram, what is this F L O S S? What is that gonna Oh, wait a minute, I see it. Never mind. Fossil. Yep. Okay, so then beach. Drift? Wait, we just had if you catch my drift on connections, uh, drift wood. There we go. Bottle. Okay, beach. What is this? Wait, no, it's gotta be like this, right? Beach comb combing? Is that a term? Beach combing? I didn't know that was a term. Okay. Shell. I was thinking shell. I was like, I wonder if shell's on here. Like, that should be on here. I didn't see it immediately, so I just kind of overlooked that. But, yeah, it was, it was sitting right there the whole time. Shell. Um, okay. Um, yeah, I've never heard of the term beach combing. I mean, it makes sense. I can, I can guess what it is, but... Um, I'm just learning a lot of stuff today. I, there's, there are a lot of things that I just don't know. And I'm, I'm learning them today. So cr crosswords and connections and uh, strands, it does that. So, um, all right. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. <laughs> I hope that my, you know, relative, um, we'll just say, I want to say stupidity, but like, we'll just say my relative lack of, of, knowledge of facts and definitions of words like i hope that that's not too much of a <laughs> of a reason why you don't want to watch me like i do my best like i never i never ever claimed to be good at these games i i originally i i only started like when i first started these games like i was only playing wordle because wordle's the game i can play you just gotta guess one five letter word right and I, i'm pretty good at puzzling out you know letter positions then I started adding on, you know, connections and the mini crossword, and then strands came out. You know, I never, I never claimed to be good at these games, guys. So uh, I, I really just, I want to say I appreciate you guys watching. I know there's a lot of new people that that found my channel recently, and I, I, I just want to thank you guys for, for, uh, for um, you know, watching the videos. And uh, I, I would love to hear what your guys' solves were. So leave a comment. Let me know how do you guys do on these games. I really do um, love reading your guys' comments. So um, I'll be back tomorrow to play these games again. Um, and every day after that. So uh, with that being said, guys, um, have a great rest of your day. And I'll see you guys next time. Take care.